It's important for cattle of all ages to be protected against respiratory disease. Enforce 3 Intranasal Vaccine protects against three key viral causes of respiratory disease. Proper administration is the first step in effective protection. Let's begin with a syringe and vaccine that has been mixed according to the label instructions. Insert the needle into the rubber stopper of the mixed vaccine bottle. Fill the syringe with vaccine. Remove the needle from the syringe and replace with a cannula. Be sure to handle the cannula only by the collar to prevent contamination. The cannula allows for proper placement of the vaccine in the nasal cavity. Switching to a new cannula between cattle will minimize the chance of spreading disease through the process of vaccination. The dosage for Enforce 3 is not dependent on the size of the animal. Therefore, all animals, regardless of weight, should be given a 2 milliliter dose into one nostril. Enforce 3 can also be administered with a pumpet device by placing a mixed 50-dose bottle in the slot and pulling the grip up to administer the vaccine. Enforce 3 is an intranasal vaccine. Properly restraining the animal's head and neck is key to successful administration. For larger cattle, it is important that the animal is first properly restrained in a head gate or chute. Use the cannula or puppet device to give the animal two milliliters of Enforce 3 in a single nostril. Be sure to use a new cannula for each animal to prevent the spread of pathogens. Make sure to grasp the cannula only by the collar when removing. On the puppet device, Use a clean paper towel to wipe the tip clean between calves. Young calves may be too small for a typical head gait in the chute. In this case, you may need to restrain the calf by hand or on the ground and administer the vaccination with a small syringe and cannula. Make sure not to extend the calf's head and neck upward as this opens the windpipe increasing the chance of fluid going into the calf's lungs. Always consult with your veterinarian if you have questions on proper administration of vaccines. And that's how you administer Enforce 3.